Hi everyone, it's Victor from webautomation.io and in this video, I'm going to show you how to scrape Aula, uh, which is by far one of the biggest directories for business information. And I'm going to be using Web Automation's predefined extractor, which allows you to be able to extract data without writing any code in just a few clicks. So the very first thing you need to do is to be signed in or sign up for an account if you don't have one already. If you have one, just sign in and head over into the app and the dashboard. So the next step is that you head over to the marketplace where all the predefined extractors are kept. And then you search for Aula. There we go, it's the Aula Web Scraper. You need to activate this into your account. Great. Now the next thing you need to do is put in a starter link and a starter link is just the link from Aula. So you head back into Aula. Uh, I already have a search done for Aula, but you can search for any company in Aula. Once you've done the search, just copy the URL, which looks like this. Go back into Web Automations to paste it into the starter links option, update links. That's it, that's all you need to do. You can add multiple links if you wanted in here. Uh, once you're happy with what you have here, all you need to do is press the run button. Voila, there we go. It's gonna start scraping all the valuable information from that page. And then we can see it in a few seconds. There we go, guys. Uh, you can see that it's completed now. I have one row and you can download as a CSV, XML, Excel, JSON, or JSON line. I'm going to use Excel and download it to my local. And then we can have a look. There we go. You can see the outline information. I can see uh, leader first name, leader last name, uh, leader's LinkedIn profile, uh, leader's Twitter, uh, leader's image. So you can see uh, on and on is so much valuable information inside here, which has just been scraped. Uh, and I showed you how to do that quite easily uh, with just a couple of clicks. So head back into here now. I really like you guys to try this out yourself. Uh, don't forget, just go into the starter links option and put in as many links as you wanted, uh, all on separate lines, and start extracting and getting some, um, some incredible data. So thanks a lot for watching the video, and I'll see you at the next one.